What's up? My name is Bun Boss. Today we're going to go through three permanent setting changes coming to Final Fantasy 14 here on out. Make sure to hit that like button to support the channel or whatevs. Setting number one comes to character configuration. We'll now have RGB values displaced when selecting certain features including eye color, skin color, and hair color. Many players like to, as well as other games, often work off a value system and I'm happy to see they're finally updating Final Fantasy XIV to operate the same. We will have a marker added to the character sliders which means we can view the previously selected value. I know for me I always struggle with wait was this the same one I was just at or is it a little lighter or a little darker. They are also adding a help message when selecting birthday and patron deity that will let new players know that this has no effect on their gameplay. They should also add this to the picking character race as well since this also doesn't affect your gameplay. One day they will give us a more robust system for character creation. Well, one day we hope. Setting number two comes to display names. You'll have the option to turn on display job icon next to a person's name. This is an easy way to determine which player is who as well as where the tank is at. I know that I personally have had some times where Lala's were tanks and I thought they were the DPS character or vice versa. Party member roles can be adjusted to reflect the color of the role they are playing in party chat. Now this isn't all too exciting for our colorblind folk in game but it's going to be a really nice upgrade for those who actually talk in party chat. You will be able to determine DPS from red names, healer from green names and I'm guessing tank with blue names. I know I've seen mistakes where I said pull bigger and the tank said only if the healer says it's okay and I responded with I am the healer. I keep my own party list to first name and initials so I can't really blame them and it can be hard to determine who is who when you're just running regular duty roulettes. A great quality of life update. This is also accompanied with a pretty big update to the chat log name display settings which will help you turn off and on these features. I will put out a short form content video covering this when it comes out. Number three is my favorite as a hoarder, and that is to store newly obtained items in the last open inventory slot. This means it will add it in from the bottom, which is going to be great for determining what you got from certain events, duties, or gathering, or even retainers. I mostly sell my crap stuff to an NPC vendor, but now it'll be nice to have a completely separated so I know at a quick glance what came in. All in all, these are solid updates to the settings and hopefully one day we'll get a complete revamped character configuration or a more robust update, which is hopefully coming 7.0. I do make a ton of guides and tutorials for Final Fantasy XIV, which you can find in my playlist down below, whether you're looking for job guides, controller guides, crafting and gathering guides, island sanctuary guides, I make it all. Thank you to my Patreon and YouTube and Discord Bun supporters as you guys make this channel possible. If you want to watch more Final Fantasy Guides content, then you can click here.